Hello, everyone. My name is Dion Morales, your host of the Gold Squadron Podcast, and we're coming to you live from the top eight of the European Championships, live from Krakow, Poland. We're on a world tour, baby. My co-host for this round is... Andrew Knuckles of the Birmingham Barons Podcast. How's it going, guys? So today, we have a repeat. <laughs> we have Dave Crow Dale Cromwell, not Dave, Dale Cromwell that, we, that played yesterday in by far the most explosive match of X-Wing I have ever seen. <laughs> I think it lasted maybe six rounds. Oh, whoa. And it was incredible. So much variance. Let's see if it happens again. So Dale is running Darth Vader, fire control system with afterburners, soon tier fell with Predator, and Dutch is with Predator and Fifth Brother. It's like a 17-point bid. Yeah. Something, something crazy it's, like it that. It is 17 points. <laughs> And it's funny, like I was talking to uh, Tyler Tibbet of Team USA. He goes, yeah, that's what he needs for the double Jedi. Yep. That's, yeah. yeah, just to make sure that you have it. Yep. So then on the right side, we have uh, Piotr yep. running Nia Num with heroic S-Foils, Pattern Analyzer, and Black One. Lieutenant Bastion with S-Foils. Kova Nell with heroic and Leia Organa, our first Leia that we've seen all week, right? Yeah. Uh, or Leia, like General Leia Organa, right. I should say. Because we've seen the Leia crew for the Rebels, but this is the Resistance. Then we have Finn in the pod with Heroic. I think that's right at 200 points. Uh, 199. So, Red Barrel roll there from Finn. Yep. So I really like both of these lists. Uh, we've seen the, the Vader soon tier fell Duchess. We, saw, we watched it last match. We've seen it. Saw it yesterday. I think we maybe have one more that we saw as well. Yeah. Um, and it's a great list. It's very consistent. You have two I-6s and an I-5, all with repositions and, and reactive ways to do things. They're good lists. Yeah. So a couple of abilities to, uh, to remember and to think about during this game. Remember that Duchess does not have to use her ability. Yep. Okay. She can use it while stressed. Right. She can she can do ailerons while stressed or not do them at all. Um, I think that might might really matter, especially with uh, Piotr being past the first player with yep. that deep bid. You know that Duchess wants to move after. <laughs> oh uh, yeah. All these all these basically five advanced sensors. sensors. Correct. Um, you know, looking at Piotr's setup here, most players feel obligated to start these type of ships in like a block formation yeah. or something like that. Not here. Yep. You know, obviously these guys are in the top eight. They know what they're doing. Um, they've played really, really well. And it's interesting to see this, the, the setup here being wide set. He started from a corner, kind of fanning out. Um, now Finn is slow. He's the slowest ship in the, even slower than Kova. Maybe they're about equal. But, um, so right now, definitely favoring more the, the top of the board movement. Yep. But can definitely still come this way if needed. Still protecting. Yep. Uh, one thing to note here, too, um, it, it looks like he didn't set up Finn on a 45 degree. He did not. So I don't know if that was intentional or not. But it that could be, you know... It it just makes the maneuvers a little bit more weird because yeah. it's a little bit harder to calculate where yep. you're going to go. Uh, so we do have our choose your champion in chat. Ones and twos. Let's see them. Let's get, let's get all the votes. <laughs> so looking at um, uh, Pilt's list. Yep. Uh, Neon Num obviously is like the super Neon. He has black one pattern analyzer heroic. Um, he can he can gap close and um, get behind stuff with the talent roll. Still get all of his actions like yes. crazy crazy efficiency for one turn. And you still also have Leia Organa in the list, being able to just say mm, that's not actually a red this turn. Yeah. And the the interaction with Leia and Kova matters here. So yes. just in case you're you're not familiar with it. So the let me just go ahead and straight read it because this, the wording matters. Leia Organa says, after a friendly ship reveals its dial, you may spend one charge. If you do, the chosen ship reduces the difficulty of that maneuver. Then you go back to Koba's ability, and it says, 
while you defend or perform a primary attack, if you revealed, and that's the key word here, yep. revealed maneuver is red, you roll one additional die. So Leia just changes what you, the maneuver that you're, the, basically the template. Think yeah. about it that way. The template has changed color, but what's on the dial, the it color not still changed. stands. Right. So what you'll see is Covenel can do basically a reverse or one hard or three bank um, and do the red maneuver but then have its difficulty re reduced so you still get the actions, but then you get all the benefits of Covenel's ability. Oh, Vader coming in. He's v hot. Dale is an aggressive player. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just saying this now. <laughs> Dale is absolutely an aggressive player. All right, we're going to hurry up and get your poll in here. One <laughs> or two, choose your champion, ladies yep. and gentlemen. So you, you absolutely... If, you, we, there's not, we're not going to have a repeat of... Uh, uh, maybe it was yesterday morning where we didn't engage for 35 minutes yep. for one game. Checks for lock out of range. Yep. Take well, it on there. Well, it's, because it's, there is jam on the list. I will tell you that. It's important that uh, that you put that out there because I believe the pod can jam. Yes. So. Yeah, so it can get in there. Yes. But it, it is slow. Yeah. No, I mean like the jam action. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, it, it is slow to get into that range yes. one. These looks, these ships look so good. They do. Yeah. So we're going to see a pretty pretty aggressive approach uh, for both players here. Now, Vader, Vader obviously, he, he can only go a couple directions here. And that, that could be a problem mm -hmm. just because we just have this entire, this entire area right here yeah. that is a no-go zone. You definitely don't want to. You definitely don't want to fly Vader into that. So what? What's the safest move? Do you, are you? You could say you could, you could see a three hard and then an afterburner to get out, to to make, to make Piotr commit in. Okay. That that's that's kind of what I'm thinking. But what like, would Dale do? Would he just fly forward here? No, no. I'm, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, you, you you could no. You won straight, uh -huh. and you just say, "Come at me, bro." <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> this is top eight. We're honorably jousting here. <laughs> now you probably will just see. I don't. I don't know what soon tier does here. <laughs> Absolute unit. <you> yes. <laughs> All right. Looks like I may have spelled something wrong here. Kucharski. Kuchar. I missed an R. Kucharski. Boom. Sorry about that, Piotr. Oh man! So, but I yeah, I don't know what Suntier does here. Because you you could you could see the bamboozle, and everyone just tries to carve in and catch catch Suntier because mm -hmm. he he is definitely the probably the bane of this list. Yeah. Just because he has the double reposition, we've seen how hard Suntier can be to catch. It's almost not worth it unless you just get a free free shot into it yep. just like randomly. And then with Finn out there being being so offensive. You know, you don't want Finn to catch yep. soon during the arc, though that slight cant, which we talked about in the, remember we were talking about his weird angle? Yeah, yeah. Uh, that actually happened in the opening. Piotr moved Finn first, uh -huh. bumped, and then Interesting. Bastion. Uh, I'm not entirely sure if it was intentional or not, but honestly, those type of weird angles when you set up soon tier at a 45 could end up getting you that just a little bit of extra degrees you need to get an angle. Yep. So we have Bastion carving in, trying to go for a block. Looks like we're collapsing down on Vader here. Yep. Trying to trying to get rid of the Lord of the Sith. <laughs> well, I mean, if he does anything but the hard three, you wanna, you're going to punish him uh, for it. Five straight. Five straight will fit now. Um, it may not fit now, <laughs> <laughs> but but that's how like if he if he bumps into COVID, that's actually not a bad no. that's not a bad thing. I'm assuming Nian's coming in too. Yep. Uh, and I will say too, he definitely can just fit a one straight here. Yep. And he won't get shot at by. He won't get shot at by Bastion. Three bank focus. So we have Duchess probably just doing a one straight three bank. Yep. Sorry about that. <laughs> oh, hello. <laughs> hello there. Obi-Wan's not in this list. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> so 
So I think I actually think you I don't think you barrel roll inside. I think you barrel roll on the outside. Yep. Just so you have more information of where you need to go. Especially with the ailerons. But just taking the focus. That's not I mean that's not bad. Nope. He wants to have the mod. Yep. So that is a three bank from Soon Tier. Like I said, aggressive. Very aggressive. Probably just barrel roll out of Finn's arc here. Yep. Uh, I don't. Uh, I, no, he doesn't even. He doesn't even have arc. There's no way. Oh, you're right. Sorry. I'm sitting. I'm sitting. You. You got the monitor. <laughs> you're the monitor side. <laughs> There's no way. I got this but little picture. He, right he here. definitely has bullseye. So I actually think you boost. Well, no, no, because you you want to be careful of, of Kova here, yeah. depending on where Vader's going. If he has range three, uh, the bullseye's probably on. Might be catching the edge of Finn. Making making some decisions on, on the action choices mm -hmm. for soon tier. It's always important. Evade boost. Evade boost going for it. This is why I love Dale. He's so aggressive. This is this is exactly my play style. Yeah. <laughs> you want to play? Let's play. Let's play. All right. We're going to go ahead and close the Choose Your Champion poll. Dale is up in the uh, in the charts 60, here. 66 to 33. And just a one straight out of Vader here. So the, the real question is, who does Vader target lock here? Do you, uh, you probably do you just take off Finn now. Yeah, you just go for Finn. Yeah. You have the range one. You have Predator for soon tier. Yep. Uh, and he only has one focus on Finn. Like, a lot of people are putting that, like, uh, perceptive co-pilot to get double focus. Yep. Like, it, it's great, but it makes Finn significantly more expensive. Yes. You can't fit all the pieces that Piotr put in his list. Correct. I, the, I the weakness is that it dies much faster. Yeah. Yeah. I, going on to Kova. Interesting. All right. I mean, that's the Leia carrier. Yeah. It's the enabler for the list. Yeah, gets the uh, gets the focus. They're checking the bullseye. Oh yeah, he's got it. And here we go. We got some shots coming in. And looks, looks like, like a range two. Ooh, that's a good catch. Going into Kova. Predator. Look at that, just the slow <laughs> spending it. Three hits. Two hits and a crit going into Kova. And reveal the red. Spends probably the focus here. Now, I mean, he really wants he that. He wants the offense. He wants the blood. offense. That's the problem. But Vader, Vader has a lock on him, too. Yeah. Thing is like. Yeah, I mean, like, a, a crit's probably just happening this turn. There's nothing you can do about it. Yep. Tough, tough call if, here. If Vader gets, like, I mean. I mean, you could, you I think could you see. Have to, you have to spend the focus here to give yourself a chance yeah. for Vader to do, like, only two hits only, and you roll Natty yeah. 2s. I think you spend it. <clears throat> yep, there it is. Okay. So, two shields. Solid shot out of Soon Tier. Vader, also range 2. All right, Vader uh, whiffs there. So there's a crit, and you absolutely spend this lock here. Wants those two blanks. Probably, do, do you t do you spend the lock yeah, here? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I mean, you, you, you have the edge. You need to go ahead and get that crit in. Ah, uh, two crits. One and one shield. Shield crit. The void's a crit. Yep. So it worked it work exactly how we you talked about. He had to spend that focus yep. to give himself a chance. Yep. You you really want to get that crit in as early as you can. Yeah. Because you could like put a uh, like panic pilot or something like that on it. Yep. Uh, so shooting at Vader looks to be a range two, I believe, or no, range three. For two hits, coming into Vader. And, and one. Spends and spending. Oh, he has a focus. You good? You spend the force here. 
just double checking. He's like, yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> That's fine. Duchess does have. Oh, never mind. This one is not running Predator. Oh no, it is running Predator. Not yes. not Shield upgrade. There's too many different variants. Here's here's Pred. Oh, just one. And it probably doesn't matter. Ooh, taking a shield. <laughs> one <laughs> Dale with the finger guns. Yes. This is the kind of game we needed. Yeah. Yeah, a uh, pick me up. Yep. So one shield off of Neon Numb. Range two from Kova going to Innovator. There you go. I take it off the wrong one, maybe? Uh, yeah, you take I it did. off the wrong one. There you go. No focus, one crit only. This is going into Vader. And Let's evaded. Save. And Finn, range two. Builder has a very interesting way to roll. He rubs them together and then flings them. Yeah, we had somebody somebody else on day 1A that did that. Ooh. Whiffs. Taken two on Vader. An explosive round. Shields are down. I mean, when you get into it, this is what happens, right? Yep. Like, he's, he's weighing those pros and cons. No points yep. scored, but the offensive... I want to talk a little bit about his strategy, right? So he's going, he's just going in for it. A lot of players with these AC lists dance around for a long time, which gives players um, a longer, a, a longer time to set up and diagnose yep, what to do, how, how they're <laughs> going to play. Uh, I, I will also note this is Dale's second first combat in a row that one of his aces has completely blanked out on three dice. Yes. <laughs> In both of our matches, Suntir blanks out, Vader blanks out. Just, just try again. <laughs> just try again. So Duchess is in a weird position here because I don't think... I think the one bank to the top fits. Oh, I don't think the one bank to the top fits at all. There's no way. Uh, you're you're going to clip right there. 50% uh, chance you're fine. I mean, you're probably going to take it anyway. Or you won hard and That's a not get a shot. Yeah. Well, Bastion is obviously going to be coming around this way. So I would say that I actually think uh, Piotr came out ahead on that one after yeah. the two shields on, on Vader. Yeah, for sure. Like that, well, that, Vader is the heaviest hitter. Yeah, that, that was an unexpected outcome. But that's what makes the game fun, right? Absolutely. Before we go too far, though, I want to say thank you to our sponsor, Curlpaw Creatives. Use coupon code TEAMUSA for 20% off of all your acrylic game token needs for X-Wing, Destiny, all, all kinds of stuff. Check out the shop. If you need the link, go ahead and type exclamation point CPC in the chat, and you'll find the link there as well as a reminder of what the coupon code is. Uh, something else we got to talk about here, guys, because we are coming down to the last few games. Uh, we are Americans in a foreign land, and there are two other streams going on here. We're going to talk to the guys and figure it out. Most likely the final will not be here on Gold Squadron. Uh, make sure to check out First Earth. If you haven't been doing that yet, uh, Simon's been doing amazing work here in the European community. If you type exclamation point euros, you will find the link to First Earth as well as the Krakow Legion stream. Uh, out of Poland here. So we're going to talk to the guys. Of course, you know, they've been, we're the guests here, and uh, we're on a world tour. We, we've done our job. We've yep. covered the world. We've, co yep. we've covered it. And uh, if we don't get any more games today, that's cool. And I'm excited to see how this event shakes out. Yep. So what do you think Covenel does here? Do you actually, I think, doing a reverse and... <laughs> I haven't thought about putting in hidden commands. Hidden that's a, commands that's, that people could do. That's that's actually pretty cheeky. Um, but I, I think Vader is going to just try and bug out this turn after taking two shields. That's pretty dangerous. Yeah, you got to go. Still has afterburners. Yep. And it's inter interesting to see how players use afterburners. Some players automatically go in with an offensive mindset. Yeah. Like this... The afterburners is for me to like, talent roll and afterburners get a shot again yep. or K turn and do that. Uh, I mean that's that's how it was with with Hatchet Man. Yeah, exactly. Like, you you have to be maximum aggression. Ch choose violence. 
I love that. I love that saying. <laughs> For X-Wing. For X-Wing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Let's be clear. If you don't know what we're talking about, check out our coverage uh, earlier of, of Buenos Aires. In the wor- in Buenos Aires on the world tour. So one bank out of Finn here. Gonna Say, don't one forward, Vader. <laughs> don't do it. Kova gonna, Kova gonna smack you. <laughs> you know, uh, Kova does have a reverse to cover the escape for yeah. Vader as well. Yeah, that, that's what I was saying. Yeah. Maybe Kova just reverses here. Could, and could go the opposite direction too. Yeah, yeah, and, and go so here. Make the art wide in the arc. No, just or, doing the one heart. Just do a one heart. Yep. That's two. <laughs> Looks like he did use Leia there to make it a executing white but revealing red. Yep, trying to decide on actions. Take it to focus. One bank. So right now has shots looking in the direction of Suntir if Suntir comes in slow. And as well as able to threaten Vader a bit. Dale trying to figure out if he wants to use advanced ailerons or not. So choosing to not barrel roll last turn, even though he did he did get a shield for it. Yeah, he yeah, he got a free shield for nothing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but it's it's definitely put him in a little bit of a pickle. We'll see what he chooses to do. Do I take the rock? <laughs> <laughs> Or do I not? I mean, you got to be careful. You roll that crit, and it's a direct hit. You just gave up half yeah. points. <laughs> and I've seen it happen way too many times yes. for it to be like, oh, that never happened. No, it, it does. Yep. It absolutely does. Trying to debate. <laughs> Talking about the chances of, uh, of Duchess just getting completely plastered here. Yep. May have gone fast. He probably went fast. Dale likes to go fast. He does. <laughs> he, he's very aggressive. And I told you it would hit the rock. Yes, you did. And you were correct. Today. I told you. Oh. Ooh. Be- now, he still gets his action because... His normal maneuver did right. not go yeah. over Right, yeah, doesn't count yep. for taking away your perform yep. action step. But that is um, very scary. I think he figured that Bastion was going to... Okay, no damage. No damage so on the rock. Absolutely no consequences here. But I think he figured that Bastion was going to be facing this direction. Yeah. Not the Talon roll. So that's pretty terrifying. Barrel roll gets him out of... Gets him out of Kova's. Kova, yeah. And maybe, maybe Finn. Probably not Finn. Uh, Bastion still has that range one. Making sure everything's everything's solid. Taking a focus there. Yep. Another thing that really helps out Finn and his uh, offensive potential is the fact that he actually has such a low initiative. Uh, looks like he just did a one straight. So kind of kind of picking the litter here for, for Piotr. Yeah. Well, Dale might. What is he going to do with Soon Tier? And just crashing in. So he, here's the idea, I think. I'm going to give you all three, but I'm going to get shots on something. And I'm going I'm to try. I'm going to make sure it happens. Exactly. I'm going to cripple something, and then you, you get to choose, but we're going to go from there. Yep. So I, I really think you, know, you go after Kofa here. He's got three shots on her. Yep. And he already showed uh, he's already gotten the shields off. Yep. Could take her out. Now, Vader doesn't have a target lock. Ooh. Seems strong. That's Vader going into Kova. Debating if it's better call to re-roll this with Predator. Yes. Yep, just spending it. Yeah. Spend. Ma- make make the split fire happen. Spent the force already, so just taking Taking three. two? Taking On two after spending the Kova. focus. Yep. yep. Just 
just make yeah, just making sure the. Range one with Vader, only force mods here. And yep, spending the force. No mods for Kova anymore for this turn. One Got evade, one, one crit, crit. It could still alive. Panic pilot. I think that's panic pilot. Knee ends up. So who is who is he shooting? This is Nian. Well, yeah, but who's he shooting at? Ooh, four hits. Four hits. Coming into someone. We don't know who yet. Wasn't clear. Okay, so Two it was force. on the Vader. Yep. Take. Down to one. Bastion is in this list, right? Yeah, he gets a target oh, yes. lock. Going to get the target lock. One health on Vader. This is, this is scary. <laughs> wow. Okay, so now it is up to Duchess to make sure that Kova dies here. Yes. Otherwise, you traded Vader for 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 most nothing. of Kova. Yeah. But for basically nothing. Yeah. It's Range good. one with just a focus mod. His Two predator. hits. Oh, he's got predator. He's, oh, he's got, got predator. He's got predator. And and the fifth brother. Oh man. Oh, no. Oh, he oh. lives on one. He lives on one. Oh, wow. This no. is. <laughs> oh, God. As we have the variance gods. <laughs> yes. They giveth and taketh away. Yes. Um, it, it, no arc for Kova. It doesn't look like Kova has an arc. Oh, oh ba man. Bastion's going to have ba Bastion skill can clean it up. So it doesn't look like Kova has a shot. Uh, Bastion uh, of Finn shooting at, at Duchess here. And adds a, adds a the hit, focus. essentially, because he has a yep. focus. So hit crit coming into Duchess here. Takes One a crit. takes a crit. Console fire. Console. After you, before you engage, roll a die on a hit. Take a hit. <coughs> Definitely range has two. a range two on Devader with the target lock. Evader survives here. No. Oh. <laughs> I mean, it, yeah, he's he's like, I know, I have the target lock. Just let me let me cry for a moment. <laughs> Vader has no mods. Yeah, this is the chance. All the force is gone. Out the Re box. Reroll. One, one hit. Just need one squiggle here. Oh! oh. <laughs> one damage one. into Vader. Vader's off the oh. table. 75 points scored by Biotr. <sighs> Man. Can we get some Fs in the chat? Yeah, that's... Fs in the chat. I think Dale would appreciate the Fs in the chat. <laughs> oh. oh, man. You just you just need average there. Man. Yeah, Vader getting blocked there, not yep. having any actions, and then having to just use the force economy. Yep. Uh, so soon tier and Duchess... Have to have to now spend another turn trying to kill Kova. Yes, and that's like when you have ships living on one hull. It's just the, having to spend resources to take yep. that out. You, you, I don't want to go back to my game, but my game on stream. How many like taking extra turns? Yep. To to take out a ship that should that you feel should be dead. Yep. Can be really frustrating and just takes resources. Man, <laughs> Dale like brings like the heart attacks. Right. Apparently. <laughs> Like Dale Cromwell, the most exciting stream player in X Wing. <laughs> he literally just crashes in and says, "Let's just roll some dice and see what happens." <laughs> and every time, I'm always surprised. Yep. Because <laughs> if, if Vader survives there, he pretty you pretty much never see him again, right? right? Yeah. He, he just I escapes. Agreed.
Shouldn't Kova have two stress tokens? What was the crit on Kova? Uh, it may be stunned pilot. Be oh yeah, it it is stunned pilot because he has the. Uh, I think the Polish. The Polish cards and the Polish okay. cards pilot uh, pilot is first, I believe, or, okay. or it's a different it's a different word. And it looks like panic pilot. All right. I'll just ask the judge what it is. I'll yeah. just ask, go by and ask. Yeah, I, I, but I'm pretty sure it's Sun Pilot. Uh, well, console fires on Duchess. We're, we're talking about uh, Covenel. It, it is Stun Pilot. It just looks like Panic Pilot just because it has the P, but it's the, the Polish version. Yep. One bank out of Finn here. Probably just bumping. Oh, maybe not. Oh, no. That's good. Now, the pod does not have coordinate action, correct? Let's go ahead and take a peek at its action bar. I'm not entirely sure. It no. does not. Now no, it's the, the transport that does. Yes, the transport... Um, well, it doesn't natively, but uh, Leia gives it the right, the coordinate. Taking the focus. I wonder if Koba reversed here. Probably. Just you, you probably just go this way. Yeah, I like it. Bumping in with Bastion. It does have it has a, a red coordinate. Oh, it has a red coordinate. Um, I, yeah. So it has a red and a purple. Red, red Take and a, a purple. How would yeah. you like to do this? Well, that's actually a pretty good. It, it's it's good that it adds it and doesn't just change it. Yeah. Because oh go okay. So pulling out maybe he's uh he's trying to catch soon tier trying to bug hard. out yeah. makes sense. That would be a bump. You got Bastion and Nian right there. Yep. Well, but Nian still has has to move. Oh, but I mean in yeah. in in the vicinity to in cause the, some yeah, problems. Yeah, in the area. They are looking at his options. Just a one straight out of solid. Yep. So that would cause most likely a bump train on uh, a, on a hard two, or do, what do you think that would? No, fit well, between? actually, it's possible that. Oh, coordinated, coordinated the, the boost, boost for the 4K oh, to get it that over. that was disgusting. Nice. <laughs> that, was, that was beautiful. Please clap. Very well done. Takes a focus for the action. Because Neon Num's ability is amazing. Yep. And now he gets the target lock. If you don't know Neon's ability, after you receive a stress token, if there's an enemy ship at range one, you remove it. It just goes away, uh, which then gives you your action. Yep. So he gets full mods into Sintir. So he's really hoping for a bump here. And we'll we'll see if Dale saw it and he did a three hard instead of a two hard. Maybe. You could all you could also see Suntir bugging out that way too. Yep. What what faction did uh, Dale play against the one on stream? Uh, it was Last Rebels because it was, it was uh, Corn Horn, Luke, and Wedge. Mm. You know, one of the interesting things about this these resistance lists that I've noticed, they're most successful when they don't have to go very far. Yeah. Like so Dale um I kind kind of went into the 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 mouth of the beast. <laughs> yeah. Here a little bit, especially cuz Kova, Kova likes to, you know, once I she has a lane to just be able to continue backing up and stopping. Yep. Um especially with all those the debris yeah. field that they're in right now. Someone asking, how did he get lock and focus? So pattern analyzer gives you uh, an, an, an action, action when when executing a red maneuver, and then your normal action step. Yep. Yeah. Uh, pattern analyzer is very good. It is in second edition, especially it's on different. the different. If you think people who have the old wording in their mind, where it moved the location of your perform action step to another yep. place, that's where it can get some confusion. Yep. It's not worded that way anymore. 
Dale trying to decide what to do here with Duchess. This is a this is a tough turn because you gotta you have to re, you know Duchess is kind of in an awkward spot. Yep. Now, for those of you who are watching, I want to remind you that um, the next leg of the world tour is the Australian leg, and that's uh, next weekend, isn't it? It is next weekend. Also, we have the Nova Open Stream. Oh, because so, uh, Will's doing that. Because Will is doing that one. So Will Haywood, one of my <laughs> podcast mates. So what's going to happen with the timing is it's basically going to be almost 40, like two days straight of nonstop X-Wing. Because 42 days straight? Uh, sorry, did I say days? I meant hours. Excuse me. <laughs> I was For like, 42 wow. days straight. Four, <laughs> when, four. You go to, when you go to Australia, <laughs> there is a very big time difference. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. 48 <laughs> hours straight of X-Wing. What happens is um, there will be an overlap probably about the last round that I'm doing and the first one that Will's. Mm -hmm. And we have, uh, we're going to be coordinating, like, all right, I'm going to jump off of X. And you basically, we'll be u utilizing, like, at, at some points there will be one on Twitch only and one on YouTube only, and then they will switch. So we have just a one straight and a one... Misses on the debris hit. Yep. Uh, and it, it got the stress and he cleared it with yeah. the one straight. Trying to figure out what to do for an action here. He knows what Soontir's doing. We don't yet. Yep. So Black 188, you can also do this with a Pattern Analyzer Cybernetics Quad Jumper. <laughs> yes, you can. <laughs> to, to get two actions. Taking the barrel roll. Trying to, trying to get some damage into Neon here. Uh, that is putting him into range one of Bastion, though. And soon tier... Doing the too hard, it looks like it may actually fit. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, it's this close. Is a close one. And the very edge of the plastic hits right there. Blocked. Nian will have a shot there. Target lock focus. Bastion might have the angle. He's turned just a little bit. Oh, he I'm pretty sure he has he has arc there. Soon tier in a really, really crazy spot, and that may actually not even get him a focus. Yeah, because of the angle. No focus for soon tier this turn. I'm pretty sure this is a dead soon tier. <laughs> with the with the focus lock coming in. Yep, no mods. You're just hoping for natties. That was a wonderful block by Piotr. Yep. But just that difference of choosing to go down instead yep. of up. Doesn't Three even hits. need mods. I brought them. Don't need them. Don't want them. Natties? Oh, hey, Ooh, just taking one. one. Only one. So, uh, but Bastion will get the lock. Yes. Duchess shooting it. A knee in here. Uh, console fire does Do not take a damage. Take damage on crits. Here we go. One. Two. Takes one. And you just. Unless he spends nah, a focus. You just spend oh, the he focus. Yep. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I, for I forgot. He didn't need mods. Kova shooting into Duchess here. Range two. We'll have an additional die because of, it, of uh, revealing a red maneuver. Yep. Two hits coming in. And taking one, the, that is half the points force. on Duchess. My voice is starting to go. Can you <laughs> hear it? Yeah. 
<laughs> now, now uh, Pio Third is trying to figure out: Does he change targets uh, for the for the lock? Because uh, Duchess yeah. did take a shot. Actually, I think you actually do that. I think you take the shot on Duchess. He has range one. He has range one. I think he might have range one of both. Just okay. Just shooting into soon tier. All right. Spending lock. the lock. And two hits coming in soon tier here. Just need one squiggle. And there are the Ooh. natties. Natties. <laughs> Sorry, you guys can't hear the table. So, you know, he's, he's basically saying that he's not upset that those evades are happening because we saw the Vader rolls. <laughs> right? The bad stuff came already. Yep. Yeah, I mean, Vader blanking out on that first shot. Yeah. So, Duchess down to half. Soontir's still at full. Kova's still alive. Yep. <laughs> and no damage done to Nian. Oh, no, one damage done to Nian, excuse me. Or at least two shields down, but one one damage in this round. Yep. <laughs> this is uh, this is looking uh, looking pretty tough. Yeah. <laughs> You know, Andrew, I was thinking, is there, is there some type of challenge I should make to the community with some crazy person out there that watches, like, like 12 games of X-Wing in a row <laughs> with the with the Australian and no Nova Open? <laughs> or could, could I be legally liable if I could put out a challenge <laughs> like that? It's probably a bad idea. I'm trying to think of what you could do for that. Because how could you prove it would be the yeah. one of the issues. Yeah, because they probably don't keep logs. You, you can't see, like, how long a single user has no. has been watching your channel. Cannot. So how are you doing that with two different channels, though? So what will happen is there's a stream key that allows us to do both at the same time. The concurrent. Right. So then when the match before the overlap would happen, stream A switches to single, uh -huh. and stream B is already on, let's say, let's say stream A, A switches to just Twitch. Stream B starts on YouTube. Okay. Then when stream A is over, after stream B's game, they will switch to the key that does both. Interesting. Yeah. So another, another tough turn here. The pod just kind of kind of getting in, getting the way, finally getting out of the yeah. way. <laughs> I killed Vader. <laughs> I've yeah. been a good boy. Yeah. <laughs> Finn's is like, I did my part. Yeah. <laughs> I brought balance to the galaxy. <laughs> Toby Z, that's that's a pretty good idea. Questions from the rounds as you Black <laughs> 188. I have watched all but one game over the last five days from GSP. Nice. I salute Dedication. You. Hold on. Give me. Where's where's my Dang it. What's his name? Taking a target lock on the soon tier. <laughs> a one one reverse using Leia to keep that white. No action for Covenel this turn. Two bank. Neon in hunting mode. Yes. And taking a focus. Duchess, let's see where where is Duchess going this turn? Top of the board, maybe a sloop. Probably a sloop. Got to get back in it, right? You're do they behind. have one Ks? Yes, they do. They do have one K. It is not a one K. It is a three bank. So disengage. Okay, I went really aggressive. I got punished for it. Yeah, <laughs> let's be cagey now. <laughs> <laughs> But that's the thing, you can't really be KG right now. He's he's up 102 points. This is true. Did Soontir do a K turn? He did a oh, K turn. When have you seen <laughs> Soontir never does K turns? What is this? This is exactly what I love to see. <laughs> like, Looks like he might get a focus. Yeah, he's going to get a Bastion. focus. Yep. 
Yep, absolutely getting the focus here. That's what Soontir wants. You have to get rid of Copa this turn. Yes. And you, you, then you have to hope that you survive. <laughs> yep. Oh, this is cool. <laughs> He's, I think you just you let it slide. You just let it happen. You have to have your focus for defense. Uh, yep. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, you, you have to. There it is. Took one crit on Kova. And Kova's down. And that is it. Nian shooting range two onto Soontir. Still has a full mod, essentially, because he didn't have to spend the lock last turn. Yeah. And here's three hits coming into Soontir. All right, Soontir, you got the focus. You saved it for this moment. Uh, he's got to spend it. Takes, Takes one, one half points half. on Soontir. One health left, no focus left on Soontir. Range three. And he's got a shot, and he has With a target lock still, yes. right? Yes. He has the target lock. Oh, Hit. who needs Hoping it? Hoping for the natties. This is four dice. There oh. it is. <laughs> Please clap. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> this is the variance that I'm talking about. <laughs> Oh man, put, put oh. a, yes. Give us right, some natties in the right, chat. Right, right, right there. I, I'm <laughs> joining. I'm, jo I'm in. Yes. Wow. <laughs> Absolutely incredible. <laughs> <laughs> I cannot believe it. I love it. I love it. <laughs> this has been a really fun match. It has. I, I think I honestly think Dale is like the most entertaining X-wing player. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> okay, so what does Sutier do now? That just did clear the console fire with her action. Ah. Let me go ahead and take that off. Yeah, yeah, because he, he did remove the uh, the token. Mm -hmm. They didn't have it down, which is why you have it on the board. That's right. Game state. Yep. Yeah, Dale is super nice. Correct. Super nice. I was I was glad to finally meet him in person. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what what does Suntir even do here? Hmm. Well, <laughs> you think? Well, I was supposed to be dead. <laughs> so everything <laughs> after this is gravy. No. Um, so the problem is right. You're you're stressed. So you ha you're stuck to your. They your have blues. a five straight green, don't they? No, four. Four straight green. Maybe four. you still just take the five straight. Nian has what I feel to be a very obvious K turn. And you just go, You're going to be in front of me soon, Tier. Yeah. Going with a, uh, a too hard here. Interesting call. Just in case he turns to the left. Yep. And probably, actually, no. Nian probably just. One forward. I mean, I like the. Nope, 4K. there's the 4K. Yeah, yeah I, I still like it. Trying, trying to cover all the bases here. Got the pattern analyzer. Trying to figure out what Nian wants to do here. Yep. <laughs> it's not the variance we want. It's the variance we deserve. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Dr. Money Pants. All right, Aileron's just coming around, trying to give some support here soon. Yep. Yeah, Duchess really needs to get back into the game. Need to start getting that damage in where you can. Yep, barrel rolling in. Now, Duchess, like, Duchess and Soontir, assuming that, that, so he, oh, he is getting blocked. That's going to be range one. Range one from Nian, and probably a range one from Fen, too. Yep. And this is kind of what I was saying is, like, 
you maybe just take. But he still gets the focus. He does so get I, the I guess focus. it's okay. He does have some mods. Maybe the natties will save him again. Uh, maybe. N now it's just paint. Now, now there he doesn't are, need natties. He just needs paint. Um, I don't think there's a target lock anymore. Uh, no, this I think Nian's. Nian's. Ooh. Here's the lock. Spending the lock. Three hits. Not guaranteed. One blank and soon tears gone. <laughs> oh, Natty's oh again! <laughs> <laughs> now Finn just is going to clean it up, though, I'm sure. Two times in a row. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Oh right, no! One hit. Finn's gonna. It's gonna be three. Yeah. So three hits yeah. coming in. He still has a focus. <laughs> if Soon Tear survives this. Oh Holy my gosh! Crap! <laughs> We're clapping. Yes, it's skill. All skill. Oh my <laughs> gosh! Soon Tear refuses to die. <laughs> Four, three, sh no, four <laughs> shots in a row. <laughs> oh man! This is real plot armor right here. See, but this is the thing, right? Piotr's like, ha ha ha, and in the back of his mind, he's going, I hate this. Oh, oh no, I, I hate this. He should be dead. <laughs> the the game is slipping away. <laughs> the sand is starting to tr because through the fingers. This this was the only turn that th there was going to be a real firing solution on Suntir. Yes, and because of that, Suntir is gone. Yeah, and and. And that's the thing too. Soon Tier can still close the game. He can. Soon Tier. Uh, Soon Tier and Duchess. When he's feeling good, is uh, feeling can, real he can, good. He can solo this these guys. Yes. Um, and I I really think too that we're going to see probably a, maybe a three straight dialed in for Duchess here, just in case he doesn't like it and he goes out that way, yep. or he can come in and be aggressive. That was incredible. And th okay. I'm going to say it again. <laughs> Dale is my favorite X-Wing player to watch on stream. <laughs> <laughs> this is so much fun. Oh, man. This has been <laughs> <laughs> the ups and downs in this game. Yeah. It, it is literally just insanity. No, no here's the funny thing, right? Uh, if if Piotr would have taken a focus, I know of course, it's the same odds. Yeah. Typically, uh, if it would have taken a focus on, he would have had four hits and killed. He would have been dead. Yeah. Yep. Oh my gosh. <laughs> That's going to be a three talon out of Bastion. I'm assuming. Making sure everything's nice and tight. Almost, almost dropping everything. Talent roll there. Yep. Bat, you got to make sure you have that shot. Now, I guarantee you, Sintra is going to die from a range three obstructed shot. <laughs> unmodified. Unmodified. <laughs> with, with focus evade. Yeah. <laughs> but the dice giveth and the dice take, taketh away, that's, right? That's right. So stress... Yep, just going to go ahead and, and move it over because we already know that that Nian's going to probably clear his stress this turn. One bank. <laughs> There's really nowhere where for Finn to go, just kind of getting in the way. Yep. One bank to go ahead and relieve the strain, yeah. essentially what this is for. Yep. And doesn't – he may fit. May fit in there. Uh, yep, it's going to fit. There it is. 20 minutes left. He's doing a two bank with Nian. He's assuming that there's going to be a, a really fast maneuver out of out of Suntir here, trying to get as much distance as he can. Absolutely, and if anything, you're in a spot to get some shots on Duchess. Yes. Unless she goes away, of course, yep. but you got to threaten. And both of these guys are, are are having a good time with this. Yes. And, and, and you know, courts matches are always are always really fun. All right, I'm curious. 
what, what do you guys think is going to happen? Yeah, no. Uh, putting yeah, up the poll. Yeah, I'm really poll, curious to see what you guys think. Ones and twos. Who do you think has it? <laughs> I, I still I still think Piotr is, is up way yeah. ahead. And there's there's not a lot of damage being done because Nia Num has five health left. But with Duchess coming back in the mix, we could see a swing. Yes. <laughs> Everyone's going <laughs> to vote for Dale just because of the dice. <laughs> Three bank coming in here for Duchess. All right, so she's going to be taking to the paint. evade, reminding himself that he has the force by putting it yep. next to the ship. That's, that's, that's what that, that that's is. That's what I do. Yeah, but it's been it's been behind the whole time, right? Like it's yeah. just like a, I got to make sure I don't forget this. Soon tier doing the three bank. Oh, he's doing the sloop. <laughs> Holy <laughs> crap. I love Dale so much. He was going to have a bullseye. He's going to have the focus. He will. Oh, my gosh. This is amazing. <laughs> he's like, Natty, save me again? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh. Has Predator. <laughs> so won't get max hits here. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> he no, you don't spend it. it here. Don't spend the Do focus. not spend it here. Yeah. You just don't spend it. Oh my god. <laughs> you can't do it. Got it. In the end, yep, no so damage. that that would have been that felt would have felt really bad. Yes. He's <laughs> 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 just he's just saying, hey, Duchess is right here. You yeah. can shoot her it's if you tier, want. You know, <laughs> Duchess is here. You can have him. <laughs> <laughs> Range one saying that Duchess does only have two defense dice. Spends a focus for hit crit. Hit crit, coming into soon tier here. Moving, moving the dice so there's no interference. Yeah. There it oh. is. Soon tier. <laughs> Soon tier finally goes down. It was a crit. And <laughs> dice to the direct. Direct. Not it. just dead, super dead. <laughs> Range one, shooting into the end with no mods. Yep. Oh. Um, yep. Got, got the predator. Got the predator. There it is. That's the crit. Yeah, you spend it. Fifth brother for Three crit, another crit. crits. Two dice. Take one. So one crit, shield, crit. one crit. What were the crits? Uh, I actually think we made a mistake at some point and took it off the wrong X wing. Because it was just shields. Oh, it was just shields? Over. Oh, okay. Yeah. Duchess can still can still clear this. She absolutely has the chance. Now, obviously because Dale was so far behind in points, he had to yeah. do an aggressive move to make sure that it happened. Double evades. Still good. Has the force. Regen. Duchess Back to versus dials. the world. Now, Duchess is still the ace in this matchup. Yes. She does get to move last. Now, we do have a black one still on the board. Yes. Whew. Man. Oh, sorry about that. 53%. Pretty sure. I'm going to run out and grab food. You guys want anything? Yeah. Ramen. Just a normal ramen bowl? Yeah. Um, no egg. Are you just going out to the food trucks? Uh, I'll be good. It's fine. Uh, put a little uh, chili oil in there. Chili oil? Andrew wants some chili oil in his ramen. Oh, I like my ramen spicy. Calientito. 14 minutes left. So I think, I think we see maybe a, well, I don't know. It's a hard call. Uh, so we're going to probably just see a, a target lock. Yep. 
showing up here for uh, for Bastion, and th this is a, this is, you expect this out of a top eight game. Like this right. is a, a crazy match. Now, obviously, variance has been absurd, right. but it's been back and forth. Yeah, but it's been back and forth, and it's been really fun. Back and forth and low stress. Yep, like high stress because it's a game, right? Yeah, Everybody, the players want to win, but they're having a good time. That is a three K out of Finn here. And doing the 4K with Neonum. Yep. Getting the full mod, assuming that he clears. Yes. He does. Yep. So Pattern Analyzer triggers, giving him an action. Then Neonum's ability is going to trigger. Because he's in range 1, he loses the stress. Yep. After that, you get your normal perform action step. Because the only thing that prevents you from getting your action when you're doing a K turn is the fact that your stress is not there. So you have that action. Yep. Target lock focus. Duchess in a dream. Trying to decide what to do here for advanced ailerons. <laughs> uh, Tyrannus B in the chat says, if the finale ends up being resistance versus, versus resistance after this field of Imperials, I'm going to weep. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, these guys have been working hard. Lots of, uh, lots of great games going on. Yeah. Lots of great players. I mean, like, every game that we've had on today has just been super close. Yes. Really good. Very exciting. And I can't, I can't understate the fact that uh, you know it's been awesome to meet the community members here. Yeah. Uh, be so accepted. And, Absolutely. And just being able to spend time with X Wing players, you know, on on this side of the pond. Yeah. <laughs> this has been awesome. Yeah, it's it's really been cool. Still, still debating. Uh, we're down to a little bit over 11 minutes left in the round. He's, yeah, he's, he's. <laughs> And I want to remind you guys, there are two other games going on that look like they're pretty close. Uh, yep. One's on First Earth. The other one is on Legion Krakow. If you need those links, exclamation point Euros. The links will be in there. So, basically, Dale has a sloop dialed in. Yeah. Uh, and Piltar is letting him, uh, letting him kind of figure it out here. Yeah. Trying, trying to figure out what to do. It's tough. It's a tough one. So you know Dale's nervous. He's chewing on templates. <laughs> <laughs> and there is the sloop with the stress. You you pretty much have to just keep going into Neon here. Yeah. Range three of unobstructed coming into Duchess. He will have fifth brother. And he has the target lock. Spend the lock three there hits it is. coming three into hits. Duchess. Have to taking spend it. One. Taking one. Down to one hit. No mods left on Duchess. People trying to pass energy to Duchess. <laughs> <laughs> Shooting at Finn. Range two. Two hits. Oop. Taking one. Taking one. So not half points on Finn. Finn gets to shoot. And he doesn't have any focus modifiers, so his ability won't matter here. Yep. He's just looking for natties. Hit, like that. Hit crit. Like that. Looking for natties. And that's how we end the game. <laughs> An incredible match. Piotr pulls it out. Dale Cromwell, <laughs> the natty king. The natty. <laughs> uh, uh, you know, natties only last for so long, right? Yes. Man. I that need, was that was a match. I need to ask uh, Dale if I could take a picture of his face so we can make a T-shirt and make him the Natty King. <laughs> the Natty King. Yeah. I, I don't even <laughs> think Duncan Howard has has that much luck. No, I don't think so. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> that was absolutely incredible. Probably like, like both games that Dale has been on stream have just been absolutely amazing. Yes. So a exciting. Absolutely. Whew. All right, guys. So it's time <laughs> for giveaways. For giveaways. Man. We're, we have to we have to come down off of our adrenaline from that one. <laughs> you know, well played for both players. And just uh, thank you to every player who has played on Gold Squadron here in Europe. Um, I don't know when I'll be back in Europe. Like, this this might be a Next one year. of the types. Maybe. Next year. Are we World, right? World Tour Part 2. Part 2? <laughs> Maybe. The Reckoning. <laughs> the, re <laughs> the Return. <laughs> the Return of the Gold. <laughs> uh, man. Yeah. I mean, I think I would like... So, we had a great time at XTC. Yeah. It was wonderful. Yeah. Like, th this event is amazing. Obviously, great players, all the stuff. But what really put the icing on the cake for me was all the stuff that happened in the XTC. Yeah. Like, the X-Wing Team Championships. If you guys didn't watch that coverage, all the games are... Are there? Um, but yeah, so just thank you to everybody who's who's helped us out here, to to the Marshall, Vince, all the judges, everybody. Now, before we do our last set of giveaways, which I do got some good stuff for you, okay? Uh, I want to thank Hanson Brothers Gaming. Tell you guys about their Kickstarter. You can type exclamation point euros in the chat to get the link to their Kickstarter on there. And what they've created here is a modular. I'll van it. That you've, thank you. It's a modular token system and uh, trays, all types of different things. It's magnetic. <laughs> Had a little uh, magnet pop out there, but you know, I, I, it it's fine. I, it dropped on the ground earlier. Uh, I blamed that on uh, on the box. The box. Yeah. Yeah. Or, okay. Well, on, on on the box over here. On the box over here. <laughs> you dropped it. <laughs> but you have like all the little tokens and stuff that can that can fit in there. Uh, really cool. Uh, and like you can even fit like a, one of your damage decks, um, including curl pod tokens, yep. everything like that. And uh, the other thing about it is they have lots of different various uh, variations on them, mm -hmm. where uh, you can actually get like double modules where it's like, like too this, too yeah. long, or they stack up on top, or of they each stack other. up on top of each other. They have this like a double length lid, all kinds of different ways to customize it for what you want. Uh, Two brothers out of Sacramento that just love X-Wing, and we're looking for a solution to fit all their different type of third-party and official tokens in yep. it. It has, like, bomb, all kinds of stuff. Um, I think probably my favorite thing in this whole set is their ship holders, where you literally, it has, like, these little hooks on it where you can hold the ships, and, like, let's say the ships are on here, you can go like this, and they don't fall off. Yep. It's, it's pretty crazy. So go ahead, check them out. Tell them Dion sent you. Actually, don't know because of the dates and all that <laughs> stuff. Unless you sign up later, which is only like 12 or something days left in their Kickstarter. So, um, And all the stuff's made already. That's the other thing. Yep. It's like it's, it's, it's ready to go. They're going to get it all together, do any final etching and stuff like that that you want to customize the lids, and they'll be ready to go. All right, let's do away, so do with some cover. Let's do away with some cards. Cards, alt arts, things, Here we stuff. go. So uh, let's go ahead. Let's do. Let's go a little crazy. Let's go a little crazy. No, nah, not too crazy. Not, I gotta save some stuff for Australia. A little here. crazy. Oh, not too crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. You basically just have this pool of stuff. Yeah. And then it's done. Correct. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So we'll do those. We'll do five cards. Cool. Something special. And then something even specialer. Specialer. Yes. More. That's what my mama used to call me. <laughs> Specialer. <laughs> in order to participate in the giveaways, all you got to do is talk in the chat. Just type something, even just one thing. Even if you're afraid, you're like a, you're one of these people who are a little bit afraid of uh, typing in chat sometimes. It's okay. This is a safe place for you. Yep. Just type one thing, and you're eligible to be uh, in the giveaway. So here we go. Three, two, one. one. Roll it. Cut off. Cut off. You're going to be getting an Aiden Versio alt art using the images from the Battlefront. Battlefront. Actually, the storyline of Battlefront is actually pretty cool. I never played the single player. No? I heard it was good, though. Yeah. I couldn't play it because the camera angles. It makes my, my brain swim. Oh, just I the, uh, the, the third person? Yeah. Can't do it. Next, Del Mico. Del. No, that's Gideon Hask. Gideon Hask. We have Del Mico here. <laughs> I said, Gideon Hask, <laughs> <laughs> you bamboozled me. I actually didn't read it. Three, two, one, get it. The real Alarith. 
All right, now. Now getting hit. Now getting hit. Uh, no, not <laughs> Del Mico. Mico. <laughs> you trolling me. <laughs> you trolling me. All right, now Del Mico. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Clem 77, congratulations. Clem de la Clem. All right, next. Luminara. 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 Three. Padme's best friend. Yes. <laughs> Three, two, one, go. Kansas 83. Not 84. I have, a, I have a feeling that you were born in 1983. Probably. Probably. I mean, making making a like an avatar name is hard. It is. Like you're like. I just I go by Sandisk because it was on my it was on my table <laughs> whenever I was trying to find a handle that wasn't like <laughs> knuckles something. Right. That's funny. <laughs> All righty. Last regular card here. Stick with us. We got two more things. Yep. Okay. We have the Captain Phasma. Okay. Captain Phasma crew. Three, two, one, go. Rhinus 4 Yeah. Uh, Captain Phasma is going to be a pilot here pretty soon, right? In yeah. In the uh, Thai SF. Yep. A little bit of ca canonical thing if you didn't read uh, the comic books. So we actually see her fly a Thai SF when she's chasing down one of the officers who found out that she took down the uh, shields of the Starkiller base. Yep. She's... Read she's the pretty, books. She's if, pretty brutal. Yeah, I she's know, much like, cooler in the books. Yes, absolutely. Much cooler in the books. All righty. So, here's what I got. Let me let me go my my goodie box. I need the white box. Where uh, is the white box? Here it is. Ground it. We got found it. it. We got it. All right. The white box. So, what I got up for grabs for this one, let's go ahead and uh, do one of our awesome... You got to show them Polish milk. <laughs> it's, it's this is D. D Yoon uh, of the Fly Better said, I must show you Polish milk. This is Polish milk. It looks... It's, it's Polish milk? Here the whole day just it has been sitting here the whole Fermenting. day. Fermenting. <laughs> Ferment. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> we can get wild with that milk later. <laughs> so, we're going to... We're going to go... <laughs> Okay, we're going to go ahead and uh, give away this Anakin Skywalker, okay? Anakin Skywalker is one of our alt arts here uh, that's been commissioned by Gold Squadron. Here we go. Who's going to get it? Three, two, one, roll it. Uh, H-W-L-R-N-N-E-R, -N -N -E 2380, How so Howl, Howl Runner, Runner yeah. 2380. All right. There may have been someone else that was also named Howl Runner, so I didn't want to like. True. Yeah. True. Howl Runner without the vowels, yeah. except for the E R. Except for the E R. <laughs> All right. Now we have the giveaway for the silver package of uh, from Hanson Brothers Gaming. Nice. Are you ready? I'm ready. Three, two, one. Let's roll it. Captain Melici. Melici. Meli. Melici? No, it would be Melici, I think. Congratulations. <laughs> Congratulations there. And, you know, I want to do one more thing. I want to do one more thing. Um, so, you know, there's lots of ways to support Gold Squadron streaming and all that stuff, uh, whether that is just by watching, using your Twitch Prime sub. By You can do that every 30 days. If you have Amazon, click the button every 30 days. If you don't know what I'm talking about, exclamation point Prime, you can literally give free money from Amazon yep. to us. Yep, just free. It costs you nothing but three minutes of your time and a click. Yep. Okay? Very, very easy. Um, but the number one group of supporters that we actually have is our patrons. You guys are the ones that made this possible. I would have never dreamed that we would have gotten where we are without you guys. So what we're going to do is um, I'm going to pull up my uh, my list of patrons here, and I want to do a patron exclusive giveaway. Ooh. Okay. Um, something a little bit different, but here we're in Poland. We're in Krakow, Poland. I want to give away a um, an ex uh, a ship expansion mm -hmm. from Poland. Okay. I got a whole whole set oh, over yeah, there. Like, it's like a whole wall yeah. of just X wing stuff. Yeah, I was just sitting here going like that. That could be a really cool prize. Um, just uh, it's different. Di obviously, the model the model's not in a different language. Yep. <laughs> But the cards are. So you just have that uh, that stuff. The, and it's you have the be, cool factor. That's right. It's going to be a legacy patron. Um, the actual ship expansion will be a surprise. You won't know yeah. until you get it. <laughs> that's right. It'll be a surprise. So let's go find out who's going who's gonna to get it. We've got to open up all the, all the secret doors. 
Also, let me remind you guys that, um, like I was talking about, the um, we will not be streaming the final here on Gold Squadron, and I'm not entirely sure about the top four. I need to talk to the yeah. uh, the locals here because we actually have three X-wing streams here. Uh, one's for Poland. One is uh, basically I'm gonna call it the European lead European streamer. Uh, that's First Earth, and of course we're here as guests. So I'm not sure. I know for sure the final will be on First Earth. Hi Tyler. It's a tippet. <laughs> <laughs> a wild tippet appears. <laughs> uh, we'll find out about the top four. Uh, but I'm pretty sure Cr Krakow Legion want it. I want if they want it, they can have it. Yep. Because we're here as guests, and they have been amazing to us. Absolutely amazing. Which is a bunch of awkward stuff happening behind us. Yep. All right. So let now me it's getting real awkward. Yeah. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. This is fine. How are you? What? What? <laughs> awesome. It's loading. Giving all stuff away. <laughs> Are you going to host a stream? Uh, yeah. Yeah, like it'll be hosted on the page. So you guys can chat with each other and stuff like that. All right. Boom. We're going to go ahead and go to active patrons. All right. Uh, D, pick, pick a number 1 through 15. 15. Oh, no, 14. 14. Okay. Uh, Tyler, yes. pick a number one through fifty. Just pick a number. Twenty-seven. 27. Thirteen. Okay, cool. <laughs> you just got somebody a thing. Okay, cool. One, well, two, well, three, one four. It could have been one through a hundred, and then it could have been seventy-two, and it would have been real easy. <laughs> <laughs> one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. What number did you say? Thirteen. I said thirteen. Thirteen. Stewart. Johnson. Johnson. Congratulations. So, Stuart Johnson, you're going to be getting a ship expansion in Polish because it commemorates our Polish trip. Yes. I think that might be Stuart, my local. <laughs> From Salt Lake City, Utah? Well, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Stuart, we're going to message you. Stuart, you want, uh, you are want a patron exclusive stream giveaway Polish ship expansion <laughs> that's bad at spelling <laughs> to come uh, in honor <laughs> in honor You're of bad at typing. our tr yes to <laughs> Poland exclamation point There you go. There you go. All right. Sent off to Stuart. Awesome. <laughs> uh, how many pilots? How many pilots in expansion can moisture pronounce? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'd love. I would love to see Ryan Farmer uh, try to try to read all this stuff. All right, guys. Give me one second, okay? And we'll do an official sign off. Just we'll be we'll brb, okay? Be right back. Mm -hmm. 